exciting. And this weekend was beautiful. We were pruning trees, chopping wood, you know, just all that fun outdoorsy stuff. Are there any trees left? Um, you know what? <laughs> when I got going, there may be a few. <laughs> okay. Well, hey, I guess you're preparing for next winter with mm -hmm. all that wood chopping. <laughs> uh, but uh, we won't be seeing any cold weather at least anytime soon. Matter of fact, uh, let's just take a look. Last time we had a high temperature of 60 plus degrees was over 110 days ago, close to about 120 days ago, going back to November 10th. The reason why I'm showing this is because we have a chance of reaching those 60 degree temperatures tomorrow. Today will be a little cooler, but still in the mid 50s this time of year. We'll take that if you like the warmer temps. We've got mostly clear skies across our area right now. There's been a few locations up into the far north which are uh, showing just a little bit of some mist, but no dense fog being reported at the moment. But the main weather story is that we got an area of high pressure off to the east. Very weak cold front pushing through right now. But this warm front, that's going to be the main trigger point, uh, coupled with this high pressure bringing a lot of warmer air here from the south. And we'll be climbing well above average, about 20 to 30 degrees above the normal for this time of year. As we head into the afternoon today, mostly clear skies. As you get to tonight, with some of that moisture coming in here from the south, could cause a little bit of some patchy, dense fog. Just a heads up as you're waking up and heading out the door for tomorrow. And then as you get into the tomorrow afternoon, anticipating a mixture of cloud cover. Now Wednesday, that's when things start to change. It looks like rainfall moves in here by the afternoon hours and will be pretty steadily at times. Could provide some brief heavy downpours in some locations. As for temperatures today, we'll be getting up into the mid 50s. And then as we head into our Tuesday, Low 60s. The only exception, unfortunately, which ends up being the case on boats every spring, cooler by the lakeshore, a term we'll start to get used to as we head into the new season. But yeah, that rainfall that'll be moving in here, here it is going into the afternoon hours, and then it starts to trickle off as you get towards Thursday morning. Rainfall totals could be anywhere from about a quarter to three quarters of an inch of rain. Right now, it's showing highest totals to the north of us and a little bit less down to the south. Right now in Green Bay, it's 40 degrees with southwest winds at 7 miles per hour across the rest of our area. Coolest up into the north woods right now in the mid-20s. Upper 40s still right along the shoreline and mid-40s in Fond du Lac at the moment. Today we'll get up to high right around 55 with mostly sunny skies and winds out of the west at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Tonight we'll drop down to an overnight low of 50, or excuse me, 30, 50, was for today 60 degrees on our Tuesday, uh, mostly sunny to partly cloudy skies. We start to cool off a little bit as you get towards Wednesday with some rainfall moving in. Could trickle off uh, just a little bit of light rain showers on Thursday, and then we do start to cool off a little bit by the weekend. So after a nice taste of some spring, mm -hmm. going more towards reality by the weekend. You know what though, Gino? What? I take a low of 50 any day. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. All right, up next, it's.